Walker, Financial News Network. TFNN, headline news update. Hi everyone, Basil Chapman here for the Tiger Financial News Network. 10 a.m. update, the Dow is up 28 to 34,163. Interesting on this fifth day of May, we've begun, we're really into May right now. And look at the rectangle between 34,256 on the 16th of April to the 33,687 low of, I think it was the 18th. Let me just double check the date of the 16th. How can it be? 16th? Uh, 20th. Uh, uh, we've been in rectangle formation, and this is the 13th session, and this can go on for a little while. Uh, these narrow rectangle formations can last a lot longer than your patience. It just needed an eye blink up today to get to the 34,257 level, and that would have been a new all time high. And the high was 34,217. Interesting, huh? And uh, what we are looking at in the days here, and I'm going to talk about that in, in my show coming up, the Tiger Technicians Hour. What happens as the day unfolds with the expectations of what should happen, what could happen, what didn't happen? And that's going to be what happens after 1 30 this afternoon. It's going to be really, really important. The SP uh, is struggling. It's up quite nicely. It's up 10 at 41.74. It was up a little more. But I have to tell you, I'm looking at this pattern, and I suggest to you that if there is a move into, in the next, it, it's either today or tomorrow, into 41.55, and that holds for 60 minutes during the day, watch out. We will test yesterday's low. So it's really important that there's a push higher later today. Look at the QQQ, the NDX 100. It is up 78, uh, 79 cents. At 330.92, hasn't taken out yesterday's high. There was this big gap. I had to put a down arrow at a peak G. Remember, we're talking about the left side and the right side. The high at 342.23 on the, I think that was the 16th, on the 16th. And then the recovery high uh, at 342.80 um, a week and a half later. And that was on the, uh, let me tell you exactly what it was, on the 29th of April. Uh, look, the technicals were very weak. The IWM today is um, down. It is very weak. And gold is holding quite nicely here. It's up about seven points. Dollar is struggling. There's a lot to talk about because crude oil did have a nice rally. Look at this. It's up at 66.52. I'll talk about that in my show coming up. The Tiger Technicians Hour. Check out my opening call, Daily Newsletter.